And now it's time for the segment. So they say, you know, where I enlighten you with a study or a survey. So they say an old art has become, well, a new trend. Listening to the gentle sound of a soft voice or a repetitive sound just to relax you or give you a tingly sensation. Here's an example you may remember. Anybody can paint. All you need is a dream in your heart, a little practice. Yeah, uh-huh. Remember that? That was Bob Ross, the late host of The Joy of Painting. His baritone voice soothed many people, and scientists call it the Bob Ross effect. So if you felt shivers or goosebumps or even felt dazed or drowsy, that was the Bob Ross effect, a specific sensory response that's triggered by whisper tones, tapping fingers, and crinkly paper. Now, they actually uh, say that um, you can get this tingly feeling when you're uh -huh. typing on the computer as well. Mm -hmm. And so, uh, honestly, personally, I go to sleep to uh, Forensic Files. You know that voice on Forensic Files? And he's like kind of like <laughs> the deathly deep voice. Uh -huh. It's soothing that to me. That puts you to sleep. Wow. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I've always said that your voice is soothing. <laughs> Um, and I've heard that before. People yeah. say you're very calming, very, you know, um, you know, I try to be smooth. Yeah. Oh, gosh. You know, sometimes baritone, <laughs> like, uh, very white. Can this be triggered in anybody? So the thing is, it's triggered in some people. It may not be triggered in others, but mm -hmm. it does aid, the people that it does help, it mm -hmm. aids them when it comes to releasing their stress, their anxiety, mm -hmm. also their depression and insomnia. So mm -hmm. it doesn't help everyone, but it does help quite a few people. There is a name for this. I've seen the videos online, like people playing with things and just those soothing sounds. I forget mm -hmm. what it's called. Called, but so why why does the brain tingle? Well, it releases uh, endorphins in our brain that uh, are are producing kind of a tingly feeling. So some of those endorphins are oxy, oxytocin, I think uh, that's how uh -huh, you say it, uh -huh. and, and that's a yeah. love hormone wow. that produces that kind of feel good sensation in your body. Mm -hmm. Also, serotonin, that's the uh, the pheromone in your body that makes you feel very happy. Ah. So that's kind of why we feel good. Well, a lot of people used to watch Bob Ross. I mean, I was yeah. one of them. You know, you click there and you hear his voice, you just kind of settle in. Mm -hmm. You get a little drowsy. Yeah, him. there he is. Very nice. Very yeah. nice. If very you're nice. not the best artist. You're you're like, I can do it. Right. Because right. Bob Ross said I can. <laughs> yes, right. It is 5